Welcome everyone to the University of Texas at San Antonio. Also known as UTSA, UTSA has made a name for itself as a leading Hispanic serving institution where students from all backgrounds thrive. With over 35,000 students and multiple campuses, this tier one university is San Antonio's largest and one of the fastest growing in the entire nation. I'm your host, Alex Boylan, and I can hardly wait to show you this amazing university and introduce you to some of its students. I think you'll be blown away by what they are learning and doing both inside and outside of the classroom. Over the next hour, you'll hear Roadrunners share their stories about how the university is helping them create their bold futures. Several of these students are the first generation in their families to go to college. It's so inspiring. UTSA really knows how to get students involved and set them up for success. Welcome to the University of Texas at San Antonio. This is the College Tour. Okay, let's meet Chloe. Chloe is a junior majoring in geography and environmental sustainability. And she hails from right here in San Antonio. Chloe loves her hometown and UTSA. She's also a second generation roadrunner. And she's the perfect person to introduce us to this great university and this great city. Kick us off, Chloe. Thanks for the introduction, Alex. Bienvenidos. Welcome to the University of Texas at San Antonio. I came to UTSA because I loved the idea of staying in my hometown while attending a nationally recognized institution. UTSA is my father's alma mater, and at his graduation, my mom dressed me up as a UTSA cheerleader. Years later, when I found that photo, I knew I wanted to follow in my dad's footsteps and become a roadrunner. UTSA is a great university in a thriving city. The school has tons of clubs and organizations that connect you to San Antonio. For example, I am one of the co-community service coordinators for UTSA's Black Student Union. Through my local ties, I plan events that bring students together from all over to work with organizations throughout the city. San Antonio is also a great city to live in. During the holidays, you can visit the Riverwalk and see our famous Christmas lights. There are hundreds of events throughout the year for you to attend, a personal favorite being Fiesta. This 10-day celebration occurs every spring and includes a carnival, parades, and other events across the city. If you're seeking places to visit, San Antonio is filled with unique historical sites. When you want to unwind, San Antonio has amazing parks and live music venues. Also, UTSA's main campus is located right across the street from an outdoor shopping center and an amusement park. Lastly, if you love food, San Antonio has some of the best food in the state from our Tex Mix to our barbecue. UTSA has taught me so much in such a short amount of time. After I graduate with my bachelor's degree, I plan to continue my education right here and get my master's degree in either geography or urban planning and make my alma mater proud. Come check it out for yourself. Hasta luego. Birds up. Mucho gusto, Chloe, and fantastic job. It's wonderful to hear about the strong ties between UTSA and San Antonio and how great cities and great universities support each other and their community. And I will definitely be back to celebrate Fiesta, so please save me a spot on the UTSA parade float. Viva Fiesta! It's time to meet Farah. Farah is a senior with a double major in finance and management. She's gotten a strong business education thanks to her professors in the Alvarez College of Business and the college's ties with the local industry. But what really made her UTSA experience special was getting involved on campus. Tell us more, Farah. Thanks for that introduction, Alex. Hi, y'all. Growing up, I had quite literally wanted to be everything, from a doctor to a lawyer to even the president. But the one thing that I knew for certain was that I wanted to continue my education. When I got to UTSA's campus, this school helped me find my passion, and from there, this campus felt like home. During freshman orientation, the orientation leaders emphasized the importance of getting involved on campus. They talked about how influential it would be to having a great college experience. And like every freshman, at first, I ignored this. Fortunately, UTSA requires freshmen to have a peer mentor, and mine encouraged me to join at least one organization. When I did, I had the time of my life. 
I met my best friends, and I started becoming more connected to the university community. I joined student government, academic organizations, and groups on campus that had absolutely nothing to do with my major, just for the sake of growing as a person. Joining these organizations helped me not only find my passion, but also land my two internships. With over 350 academic and non-academic organizations and numerous activities on campus, UTSA offers countless ways to get engaged. UTSA also has many traditions. I may be biased considering I did help create it, but one of my favorites is Light the Dome. This was something we started at the football conference championship game to show support for the team. Looking back at little freshman Farah, I would tell her that getting involved isn't scary. You get what you put into your college experience, so take advantage of your time here. That's a little bit about my journey. Back to you, Alex. Thank you, Farah, for sharing why getting involved is so impactful. I'm so happy to know that you found your best friends and also some great opportunities because of your involvement with student government, business student council, spirit advisory board, and other campus organizations. Take care, Farah. Let's meet Rashad. He's a senior majoring in cybersecurity. He also plays safety for the UTSA football team. As a student athlete, Rashad has definitely experienced Roadrunner spirit, and he's also given Roadrunner Nation a lot to cheer about. You're up, Rashad. Thank you, Alex. Hey, everyone. I chose UTSA for many reasons. First, I wanted my major to involve technology, and our cybersecurity program is one of the best in the nation. Second, I wanted to play football, and I'm grateful for the opportunity to do just that. Finally, being from San Antonio, it was an added bonus to stay close to home and help build the UTSA athletics program. I made the decision to commit to UTSA when I was 17. Looking back, it was the best decision I could have made. UTSA athletics is full of passion that fits who I am and the character of my family. Our coaches and staff make me feel supported, both as a student and as an athlete. Just one example of that unwavering support is the Roadrunner Athletic Center of Excellence. It's our hub for building our strength and balancing our lives as student athletes so we can succeed in school and on the field. Let me tell you, Roadrunner spirit is unbelievable. It's a vibe that you can feel when you're on campus or at a game. Campus life really comes alive when there is an event of some kind going on. Playing in Alamo Dome, things can be pretty rowdy, especially when you have 40,000 fans all screaming at the top of their lungs. When I am on the field and I hear that roar of Roll Runner spirit, it's like nothing else. I have learned a lot in my time here. This university has given me resources to be successful in whatever I do in life. The future for UTSA and for me is bright. Back to you, Alex. Your future is bright indeed, Rashad. And that Roadrunner spirit from all the students was truly rowdy. What do you think, Rowdy? Thanks again, Rashad, and go Roadrunners. Let me introduce you to Caitlin. She's a junior majoring in marketing with a minor in languages. Caitlin is active in the university's TRIO Student Success Services Program and the American Sign Language Club. She's gonna talk about why living on campus is a great foundation for your UTSA experience. Take it away, Caitlin. Thank you, Alex. I hope you all are doing amazing today. I want to share with you why I chose the University of Texas at San Antonio. Growing up with a single mother and six brothers, I always knew that when I was ready to leave the nest, it would have to be for a place that felt like home. And I have to say, there is no better way to make campus feel like home and to start college with a strong foundation other than to live there. At UTSA, there are a variety of on-campus housing options. They range from common residence halls to apartment-like living spaces. When you live on campus, you're already super close to amenities, such as our dining halls and the Campus Recreation Center. In my experience, the best part about living on campus are the resident assistants, or RAs who work hard to ensure that students experience college life to the fullest, both socially and academically. When you live on campus, you're always in the middle of all of the action. 
some of my favorite events happened during a back to school celebration called Roadrunner Days. During the first two weeks of classes, the university schedules tons of interactive events to welcome in the new school year. Students living on campus get to take full advantage. I enjoy this time because there are an abundance of opportunities to get familiar with the campus and meet new people. I have made countless connections through living on campus. And after graduation, I plan to go abroad to utilize the skills that I have honed here at UTSA. Birds up, Alex. Great job, Caitlin. It's easy to see that living on campus has greatly enhanced your Roadrunner experience. And it's so awesome to know that you paid that forward by becoming a resident advisor yourself. Thanks for telling us about what on-campus life is like at UTSA. Okay, we've heard a lot about UTSA's campus culture. It's time to hit the books and start talking about academics. Here to get things rolling is Joshua, who's gonna tell us about the UTSA Honors College. UTSA students are preparing for their future careers by learning from top faculty in their classes and by participating in out of the classroom experiences. Take it away, Joshua. Thanks for the introduction, Alex. During my senior year of high school, I knew I wanted to study electrical engineering. My goal was to attend a university where I could stand out and make a difference. After touring several colleges, I knew that attending the University of Texas at San Antonio could make that goal a reality. I decided to enroll in the UTSA Honors College, and I'm so glad I did. The UTSA Honors College has helped me tremendously, both in terms of standing out as an engineer and growing as a person. My first year in the program granted me the opportunity to participate in the Honors Study Abroad in Costa Rica, there, I was fully immersed in a new culture. I even made a lifelong friend on the trip. The Honors 101 class gave me the push I needed to seek out research opportunities here on campus. That was the single best career decision I've ever made. UTSA is a tier one research university with tons of programs for undergraduate researchers. One of those programs, funded by the National Science Foundation, is how I got my start in the Unmanned Systems Lab. Today, I'm a published author in a peer-reviewed electrical engineering conference and had the opportunity to present my research in DC. This past year, I led a team to first place in the Excellence in Senior Design Electrical and Computer Engineering Showcase, where we competed against a dozen of the best schools throughout Texas and New Mexico. Now, I look forward to continuing my education and research by enrolling in UTSA's new graduate program in artificial intelligence. And thanks to the Honors College for helping me along the way. Back to you, Alex. Thanks, Joshua. It's wonderful to know that highly motivated undergraduates like you can join Honors College no matter what their major is. And the Honors College staff and faculty will help them to develop a customized, experience-based curriculum to fit their career goals. That is amazing. Thanks again. Let's hear from Esteban, a student in the Margie and Bill Klesi College of Engineering and Integrated Design. UTSA believes in creating opportunities for cross-disciplinary instruction and research so that students and scholars in different fields can come together to address 21st century challenges. Let's hear about one of those spots on campus where that collaboration takes place. Over to you, Esteban. Howdy folks, jumping into college, I sought out the University of Texas at San Antonio due to its nationally ranked Air Force RTC program and rapidly growing engineering capabilities. The prospect of developing both my academic pursuits and leadership skills at the same time cemented this decision. I was especially excited to learn at UTSA due to the enriching environment fostered by its faculty and staff alongside the university's stellar facilities and student resources. During my time at UTSA, I participated in lab work, volunteered as a student university ambassador, engaged with my peers through student organizations, and now find myself working in one of Texas' most impressive facilities, the UTSA Makerspace. As a student staff member, I'm able to learn about the unique machines we house in our facility, make something wacky from them, and then teach what I know to others so they can continue the cycle. 
from 3D printing to soldering electronics to even using the big machines in our shop, the possibilities of what one can create are limitless. Thanks to resources like these, I'm able to expand my education journey outside of the classroom and apply what I learned to other projects. One of the great things about facilities such as the Makerspace is that they encourage collaboration between engineering and other integrated design disciplines such as architecture and construction management. Roadrunners have the ability to advance an idea from concept to prototype to a final model, all while working in a team-oriented environment. UTSA's heightened focus on providing students with world-class resources and facilities have enabled me to take a dive like no other into my educational and personal passions. I encourage all students to take advantage of these opportunities to grow in their learning and development like I have. That's my story. Back to you, Alex. Esteban, the maker space is incredible, and it's great to see that Roadrunners have state-of-the-art facilities where they can turn their ideas into reality. It's especially cool that you get to work with your classmates firsthand as they sharpen their design and fabrication skills and create some truly amazing projects. Thanks again. Let's meet Miranda, who will talk about her own journey in exploring career paths in the modern setting of human health. She's a student in the College for Health, Community, and Policy, sharing yet another example of how UTSA is preparing students to move from the classroom to their career. Thanks, Alex. Hey, everyone. After graduating high school, the idea of finding the right college was intimidating. I wanted to go where I could gain experience in the different areas of my major psychology to help me narrow down my options for a future career path. Being from San Antonio and my dad being a proud alumni, the University of Texas at San Antonio was always in my sights. When I learned about the many opportunities they provide students like me who are not certain of their career choice, I knew this was the place for me. After just one year, my professors have helped me apply what I'm learning in my classes to the real world. An example involves my work in a behavioral neuroscience lab where we study animal behaviors and learning abilities to gauge their potential relationships with mental disorders. UTSA is a highly esteemed research institution, which means there are numerous research programs for both undergraduate and graduate students. However, research is just one example of a human health-related career. I also obtained an internship opportunity when my behavior analysis professor connected me with an autism treatment center, which I otherwise would not have known about. I get to help work with autistic children to understand and improve their behaviors. Now, instead of just choosing one career path, my experiences have encouraged me to explore all of my options. UTSA has dedicated resources to students to help them reach their goals of getting experience in their field of study so that they may build towards a successful future. Through my experiences here, I have learned the importance of working with others and making connections to help further our knowledge of developing human health and create a healthier world for us all. That's my story. Back to you, Alex. Thanks, Miranda. I love that you're gaining real world experience that's giving you a broader understanding of different health related professions and how they work together for the benefit of the community. And thanks to UTSA's many community partners in San Antonio, there's no shortage of opportunities for students to do their own career exploration. That was awesome. Let's meet Daniel, a student in the Carlos Alvarez College of Business. Daniel chose UTSA because the university has made a name for itself nationally for its cybersecurity research and education. Students at UTSA are preparing for careers in an exciting, growing field that's in a state of constant innovation. Here's Daniel to tell us more. Thanks for that introduction, Alex. I chose to attend the University of Texas at San Antonio to make a name for myself. I didn't want to be just another face on campus. And thanks to the wide array of opportunities that UTSA has to offer, I've been able to set myself apart. I majored in cybersecurity because as our society gets more dependent on technology, someone has to protect our data and information. UTSA plays a key role in supporting our national security infrastructure, armed with a world-class faculty and a reputation as an undisputed leader in cybersecurity education. As I progress through my major, I'm working with some of the most knowledgeable and engaging professors in the field who specialize in areas such as intrusion detection, incident response, and malware analysis. 
UTSA is fueling San Antonio's national reputation as the largest cyber and information security hub outside of Washington, D.C. In fact, UTSA is one of just a few colleges or universities in the U.S. and the only Hispanic-serving institution to have three national centers of academic excellence designations from the U.S. Department of Homeland Security and National Security Agency. At UTSA, I have opportunities to distinguish myself outside the classroom, one of them being my involvement with the UTSA Ambassador Organization. As a student ambassador, I help represent the university at the highest level. During my tenure in the program, I've learned the importance of service, integrity, and excellence, all qualities essential to studying cybersecurity here at UTSA. I came to UTSA because I wanted to be somebody. I know when I graduate, I will have the tools to be successful in an ever-growing industry. UTSA has exceeded my expectations and provided me with the college experience I will never forget. Throwing it back to you, Alex. Daniel, you're crushing it on campus and in your degree program. Here's something else. The university even offers a bachelor's degree in cybersecurity 100% online. So anyone could study cybersecurity at UTSA from anywhere in the world. Thanks for sharing your story, Daniel. Let's hear from Emily. Emily is a sophomore majoring in microbiology and immunology in the College of Sciences. They are part of UTSA's federally funded esteemed program, which helps freshmen and sophomores develop as researchers and scholars. It's just one of many programs at UTSA that seek to improve representation in STEM disciplines and to give students hands-on learning experience. Tell us more, Emily. Hey y'all, growing up, some of my favorite questions always started with how or why. Some things that kept me up at night were, how do cuttlefish camouflage? Why are some fungi resistant to drugs? But most importantly, why do the scientists researching these things not look like me? When looking for a university, I wanted to see research faculty and students who represented the diversity of our current day and age. The University of Texas at San Antonio embraces this new generation of researchers. We are queer, people of color, female, male, and everything in between. Throughout the university, there are programs to lift and assist those who, historically, have not had a large voice in research. Programs such as MARC, Rise in Esteem, offer undergraduate students a roadmap and funding to reach their research goals. The Esteem program helped me get into a research lab my first year here. Through the help of my faculty mentor, I developed a skill set and love for fungal mycology and its applications. Seriously, if you can't find me, check the lab. This program further provided me with opportunities to network with faculty, alumni, and researchers nationwide. I'm allowed to be a scientist without sacrificing my culture or identity. As a tier one institution, research and experiential learning at UTSA comes in many shapes and sizes. For me, it was getting to an awesome fungal mycology lab my first year here. For others, it may be doing a summer internship, studying abroad, or even participating in one of the many research showcases that happen throughout the year. Science and innovation do not happen by giving a megaphone to those who already have a loud voice. Research at UTSA does not strive to merely follow the status quo. We strive to break it. Back to you, Alex. Emily, it is so amazing to hear that you've had a chance to conduct and present scientific research so early in your college career, and to know that UTSA prioritizes undergraduate research to help students like yourself prepare for their future careers. See you back in the lab. It's time to hear from Janelle. Janelle is a senior from Lakewood, Colorado, and she is studying computer science with a concentration in data science. She's involved in the Association for Computing Machinery here at UTSA, and also in the annual Rowdy Hacks Hackathon. She's gonna tell us more about data science at UTSA. Take it away, Janelle. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. When I started college, I knew I wanted to study something related to computers, but I didn't know what. At the University of Texas at San Antonio, 
I learned a degree in tech could lead to many career paths, like application development, cybersecurity, systems programming, and more. At the School of Data Science, I have many opportunities to connect with fellow students, staff, and faculty. I get to hear technical talks from professionals through student organizations like the American Statistical Association. I get to take classes like data mining and deep learning. And I even get to apply my skills in 24-hour competitions like Rowdy Hacks and undergraduate research projects with professors. But the best part is the opportunities to learn more about data science are only growing. UTSA just opened a brand new building dedicated to data science in downtown San Antonio the heart of our region's tech corridor. Now we have students, faculty, and researchers collaborating in all aspects of data science, like artificial intelligence and cloud computing, all under one roof. When I first started college, I never would have imagined I would find so many opportunities or such an incredible support system to prepare me for my career. I'm not only studying data science, I'm solving real world problems through internships, and engaging cutting edge ideas through undergraduate research projects. All of this is possible thanks to the skills I've gained and mentorship I've been offered through the School of Data Science. That's my story. Back to you, Alex. Janelle, I can tell you're taking advantage of every opportunity available to you as UTSA builds a world-class data science program and that you're having a blast being a teaching assistant. I know we're gonna hear more great things from you and the School of Data Science. Thanks again. Meet Juan, a music major in the College of Liberal and Fine Arts and head drum major for UTSA's Spirit of San Antonio marching band. He's gonna share a bit more about what UTSA has to offer for students interested in the arts and humanities. It's time to strike up the band. You're on, Juan. Hey everyone, I've known since I was in the third grade that I wanted to be involved in music, and in high school, that's when I decided to make this passion my college major. UTSA is known for its outstanding music program, so I knew it was the place for me. Now, I'm so proud to represent UTSA as the head drum major for the Spirit of San Antonio Marching Band. UTSA is a major provider of arts and humanities programming in San Antonio. There are always concerts or exhibitions happening on campus, and you don't have to be a music major like me to get involved. UTSA has multiple music ensembles, dance clubs, and so many other opportunities that allow students in all majors to express ourselves through our talent in the creative, literary, and performing arts. In addition to arts programming, UTSA has a strong focus on the humanities. And through the university core curriculum, all Roadrunners receive a well-rounded education and strong foundation in communication, history, and those other disciplines that seek to understand and celebrate the human experience. What I love most about this university is how accepting and diverse it is. I have developed relationships with so many people, including my professors who are always helpful and ready to guide me down the right path. That's especially meaningful to me as a first-generation college student. My parents had me at the age of 16 and 18, and they never graduated high school. Throughout my educational journey, my background and that of my parents has kept me motivated to continue to be successful and push forward. After graduation, I hope to become a band director and inspire my students by reminding them that there are always people willing to help them achieve their goals. That's my story. Now back to you, Alex. Juan, I love that you're pursuing your passion for music. UTSA has so many opportunities for students to cultivate and express their talents in the creative, literary, and performing arts, whether or not they choose to pursue a career in the arts. You'll make a terrific band director. Best of luck, Juan. Let's meet Maria, a graduate student in the College of Education and Human Development who completed her master's degree and is back now for her doctorate. UTSA is a top producer of educators, administrators, and counselors in the region and prides itself on developing innovative teaching practices and research guided by principles including community, integrity, equity, and service. Over to you, Maria. Thank you for introducing me, Alex. Call me Monty. 
My passion and research is dedicated to improving educational leadership and policies. I chose the University of Texas at San Antonio for two reasons. First, UTSA has a strong and unique partnership with the school district I work in. For example, in my master's program, our school district had our very own cohort where our UTSA professors remained with us during the entire program. Imagine having teachers who stay with you during your entire schooling and become like a member of your family. Second, I came to UTSA because it is a Hispanic serving institution where everyone is expected to receive an education that is diverse and equitable. The professors at UTSA prepare students, especially those who wanna be school educators and administrators like myself, to learn how to challenge, to analyze, and to improve the systems that affect us and our diverse students. UTSA faculty and staff seek to understand you as a whole, to be mindful of the external factors that affect your life and to be there with you to overcome any barriers. At UTSA, you can do it, Roadrunners, and we can help you. Back to you, Alex. Monty, we can't wait until we get to call you Dr. Monty. It's easy to see why you came back to UTSA to earn your doctoral degree and why UTSA has such a strong presence in South Texas schools and classrooms thanks to its community partnerships and outreach. Great job. I can't wait to introduce you all to Jesus. He's an electrical engineering major and a member of UTSA's Top Scholars Program, which is a community of driven and high achieving roadrunners seeking intellectual camaraderie and opportunities to expand their learning. Jesus is gonna tell us about one such opportunity that's open to all UTSA students. Take it away, Jesus. Thank you for that amazing introduction, Alex. Growing up, I always knew that I wanted to study engineering. This started in high school in the Rio Grande Valley with an interest in VEX robotics and competitions. I toured the UTSA campus during finalist weekend for the university's top scholar program. Throughout the weekend, I got to meet current students and faculty, and I was impressed with the proud community and welcoming culture. It was easy for me to see how this type of community helps foster an innovative environment. Innovation is important here, and one way UTSA celebrates innovation is through the Big Rowdy Idea Business Plan Competition. Last year, a group of my close friends and I created a startup company through this competition. After many brainstorming sessions, our team developed a smartwatch called First Watch. It's designed for people who are elderly or disabled and helps detect serious health issues and calls first responders if the wearer becomes unconscious. It was a great collaboration between engineering and business students. And with the help of some amazing mentors, our Big Rowdy Idea won second place in the competition. UTSA not only provides a strong foundation for your future career, but also prepare students through real world experience. Whether it be research labs, internships, study abroad opportunities, or programs such as the Big Rowdy Idea, UTSA is providing a modern comprehensive education and experiential learning to help students pursue their path to success. Whatever major you choose at UTSA, you will be a part of a compassionate, diverse community that fosters an environment of innovation. I'd like to thank all the amazing faculty and staff at UTSA for this incredible journey, as well as my amazing family for all its support. That's all from me. Back to you, Alex. Jesus, congratulations to you and your friends for being recognized for your big, rowdy idea. How amazing is it that UTSA students of all majors have this opportunity to launch their own business ventures and work with seasoned entrepreneurs all while they're still in college. Great job, Jesus. Let's meet Madeline, a senior majoring in environmental science. Madeline says she loves UTSA because of the close-knit campus community and activities happening all around campus. In fact, she's gonna tell us about an opportunity the university gave her to travel halfway around the world. I'm excited about this one. Madeline, please take it away. Thanks, Alex. So you've heard my fellow road runners talk about their research and internships. That's because UTSA realizes the importance of learning through experiences. 
For me, that looked like interning abroad in Chiang Mai, Thailand. Growing up, I didn't do much traveling, but through UTSA Study Abroad program, I was able to travel to the other side of the world. UTSA offers study abroad programs across the globe, no matter what your major is. As college students, we are starting to develop an understanding of who we are, how we fit into the world, and what legacy we want to leave. I chose Thailand because as an environmental science major, Thailand represents a climate change frontier. This was my opportunity to apply what I was learning inside the classroom and help those who are most impacted by climate change. I worked at a nonprofit doing amazing child rights advocacy work and even helped write a $20,000 grant to fund heart surgeries for patients in underserved communities. My time abroad solidified my career path in the nonprofit realm. UTSA emphasizes learning outside the classroom. For me, that means taking advantage of every opportunity I get, no matter how outlandish. I've explored the business world through an internship with a local renewable energy startup. I co-founded an organization that has distributed over 2,500 trees to the San Antonio community, and I've camped in the New Mexico mountains and deserts while conducting research. UTSA is truly classroom to career. Seizing the experiential learning opportunities has made me a more rounded student and professional. Getting to travel halfway around the world combined with the unique educational experience has made my time at UTSA really special. After my summer abroad, I intend on doing some more traveling and am more intent on ever than saving the world. Back to you, Alex. Madeline, your story is amazing. It's great to know that UTSA is committed to preparing its students to be engaged global citizens. And good for you for taking that opportunity to expand your worldview and experience another culture firsthand. Thanks again for sharing. Let's meet Amanda, a multidisciplinary studies major in UTSA's University College. No matter what their major is, UTSA makes sure that all undergraduates experience a dynamic, engaging curriculum and student-focused instruction and experiences. Just as important, the university wants students to develop the lifelong skills that will aid their success in college and after college. Take it away, Amanda. Thank you, Alex. Hi, everyone. After high school, I was nervous about choosing a college. I didn't know what to expect. I was excited when I received my acceptance letter to the University of Texas at San Antonio. Throughout my years at UTSA, I have met many amazing people who helped me gain new skills and gave me the support and experiences that stay with me to this day. UTSA offers a comprehensive academic support network that will take you from your first year on campus all the way to graduation. Through the LEAD Summer Academy and Peer Mentorship programs, I have learned how to better manage my time, study effectively, and maintain a healthy balance between work, home, and school. Also, each college at UTSA has its own Student Success Center that provides specialized resources, programs, and services to prepare students for their careers. And all the staff are amazing. My academic advisor really took the time to get to know me and what I wanted to do in life to help me plan out the classes and schedules that would best benefit me. As a multidisciplinary studies major, I have created my own degree path that is tailored to my own interests. For instance, I have three focus areas, film, communications, and business. I chose these because I feel they will best prepare me for a variety of future careers. And because I'm charting my own path in my studies, I especially appreciate having that strong academic support network to help me stay on track. Being a roadrunner has been an amazing experience. After I graduate, I hope to return for my master's degree and to make more memories, as well as pay it forward with the kindness and support that I've received. That's all here. Back to you, Alex. Amanda, I love hearing about the incredible support you've received at UTSA to succeed academically and in life. And I especially love hearing that you're taking advantage of the multidisciplinary studies program to chart your own path for your future career. Thanks again for sharing your story. Let's hear from Kanan, a sophomore majoring in computer science and here to tell us more about Military City, USA. Did you know San Antonio is home to several military bases and has one of the nation's largest active and retired military populations? UTSA is recognized nationally as a military-friendly school and nearly 15% of Roadrunners are military-affiliated students. Tell us more, Kanan.
Thanks, Alex. Growing up as an Air Force brat, Texas was always one of my favorite places to live. When my best friend mentioned that he would be attending the University of Texas at San Antonio, I decided that UTSA was a perfect choice for me too. San Antonio is known for being Military City USA. With so many military bases in our city, it grants our Army and Air Force ROTC detachments access to unique training resources that others don't have, making our cadets more competitive on a national level. In ROTC, we always keep in mind that we're students first, and we support each other in our academics by studying together, individually or in organized groups, to hold ourselves accountable. ROTC is a legitimate pathway to joining the armed forces. It's not for everyone, but I think it's had a great impact on my time management and confidence, even outside of the military aspects. Some of the best friends I've made in college are all from ROTC. UTSA is really supportive of its military students, being recognized on multiple occasions as a best for vets or military friendly school. Our Center for Military Affiliated Students is an amazing resource for active duty, veterans, or military dependents. UTSA even has scholarships that favor military affiliated applicants. If everything goes according to plan with Air Force ROTC, I will graduate and commission within a few years. From there, I'll head to pilot training and hopefully end up in the cockpit of an A-10 Warthog within five years. That's all for me. Thanks again, Alex. Kanan, it's awesome. There are so many military affiliated row runners studying and working at UTSA. And what an amazing opportunity for you and your fellow ROTC cadets to be able to pursue your education in Military City USA and grow your leadership skills. Great work, Kanan. Let's head over to hear from Marin. She is a kinesiology major who hopes to become a physical therapist and work with athletic teams. She's also an immigrant from Tanzania and says she loves being part of UTSA's multicultural community and working to support UTSA students of diverse experiences and backgrounds. Take it away, Marin. Thanks, Alex. If you were to tell high school Marin that she'll be standing here in front of you talking about UTSA, I wouldn't be surprised. UTSA has felt like home to me from the moment I arrived to tour campus. As a first year student, I became involved in student organizations on campus, including the African Student Association. Since then, I have served in many leadership positions for organizations focused on the black community at UTSA. I am proud of our work to advocate for underrepresented students and provide resources to fellow black student leaders. In our Roadrunner community, we like to say we are birds of a feather. At the same time, every feather is unique and we take pride in that. UTSA provides resources and cultural heritage events to ensure that all students are recognized, embraced, and celebrated on campus. Amplifying student voices and identities is a priority here at UTSA. The Multicultural Student Center for Equity and Justice is one of many places that does just that. I'm a proud member of their team, and we work together to showcase and highlight different identities and cultures. Here you can find peer facilitated trainings and events, Heritage Month celebratory and informational events, and community gathering and resources for our Dreamer, LGBTQIA+, and multicultural community on campus. From my first day on campus, I was greeted by a welcoming community and was given a space to embrace my identity and expand my understanding and appreciation of my fellow students. UTC has allowed me to be a leader and an ally. As I look to my future, I plan to continue to fight for an equitable and just space for all. Well, that's all from my side. Back to you, Alex, and Fred's up. Thanks, Marin. I know that UTSA leaders are passionate about the university's role in advancing educational opportunities for underserved communities. And it is so amazing to hear how UTSA students like you are supporting that effort for the benefit of your fellow Roadrunners and others. Thanks again. Many UTSA students are the first in their families to attend a four-year university, as is our next student, Angelica. Angelica says she chose UTSA because growing up, one of her role models was a UTSA alum. And she also knew that the university has been nationally recognized for its programs supporting first-generation college students. Angelica, you are up. Thanks, Alex. Hey everyone, I am the first person in my family to attend college. Nearly half of UTSA's undergraduates are first-generation college students. 
and the university has numerous dedicated resources to support us, including first-gen peer mentors, student organizations, and living and learning communities. Fun fact, many UTSA faculty were first-gen students too, so they understand and appreciate the unique assets that we bring to campus. Attending a university that has a strong support network for first-gen students truly makes a difference. Also, many of UTSA's first-gen students are fortunate to have their tuition and fees covered through the Bold Promise program. Bold Promise represents UTSA's commitment to offer high-quality education to students from low- and middle-income Texas families, and it has helped thousands of Roadrunners pursue their educational journeys. On campus, I took advantage of every opportunity that came my way. One that had the greatest impact on me was joining Voices. It's the largest volunteer organization at UTSA and serves both the university and the community. This organization has shown me the person I want to be and allows me to help others in a variety of ways. People will often say that San Antonio is a huge city with the tight-knit feeling of a small community. And at UTSA, I've experienced this firsthand. College was not what I imagined. Just in my second year, I have learned new things about myself and the importance of getting involved as a first-gen student. With some effort, one can come a long way here at UTSA, no matter where you're starting from. Back to you, Alex. Thanks for sharing your story, Angelica. I love seeing those first gen UTSA t-shirts all over the UTSA campus. It's clear that the Roadrunner community truly celebrates its first generation college students for the trailblazers that they are. Great job, Angelica. Okay, our next student has built an impressive resume in college. Meet Erica. She's a member of McNair Scholars Program, the Alamo Fellows Program, Spirit Advisory Board, the Honors Alliance, and the UTSA Ambassadors, just to name a few. She's also accumulated more than 200 service hours through her affiliations and says that giving back has helped her find her own sense of belonging here on campus. Here's Erica to tell us more. Thanks for that introduction, Alex. Growing up, I've always possessed a deep admiration for UTSA and public service. I've always valued my education and a sense of belonging. When choosing a university, I wanted to ensure that my final choice consisted of an environment with the resources and academic rigor to propel me forward. A big part of the environment at the University of Texas at San Antonio is togetherness. It's evident in the atmosphere of the campus, and with more than 350 student-led organizations, there is definitely a place to find yourself and have fun with friends who will accept you for you. Last year, I had the great fortune to be chosen as a Spirit of the Roadrunner recipient. My campaign platform focused on amplifying wellness and well-being, in line with my major, which is public health, and my minor, communications. Working on this platform has heightened my passion for helping people. I've collaborated with Wellbeing Services on campus to help fellow students understand the various dimensions of well-being and develop skills to promote their own success. Through my involvement on campus with groups such as the First Year Experience, the Student Government Association, and the President's Student Advisory Council, I've been able to expand connections, develop leadership skills, and amplify my well-being message to benefit our Roadrunner community. I am thankful to be a part of a university that believes in me, invests in me, and supports me through enriching environments and experiences. Investing in yourself while impacting others is profound. The contributions that I've made will have a lasting impact. I've gained so much from being involved on campus and supporting my community. UTSA is a place where absolutely anyone can develop their identity and find a true sense of belonging. Well, that's all for me. Love to you all and back to you, Alex. Erica, thank you so much for sharing your story with us. I know that inclusiveness and respect are part of UTSA's core values. And it's so wonderful to hear how you and others put those values into practice to create a sense of belonging for all Roadrunners. Thanks again, Erica. Let's meet Giselle, who recently graduated from UTSA with her Bachelor of Science in Physics. She loved her UTSA experience so much, she now works as a post-baccalaureate fellow in a nuclear physics lab on campus. Giselle, the floor is yours.
Thank you, Alex. Hey, y'all. I always knew that college would be the start to a lifelong adventure. When I got chosen to be a Terry Scholar at the University of Texas in San Antonio, I knew that it would be the perfect place to start creating my bold future. My dream is to go to medical school, but I also wanted to major in and study both physics and astrophysics. I found the perfect middle ground thanks to life-changing research opportunities and fascinating courses that have shown me countless ways medicine and physics are intertwined. No matter what your major is, your education is reinforced by the strong collaborations UTSA forms with industry, research, and community partners. For young scientists like me, some of those collaborators include NASA, Southwest Research Institute here in San Antonio, national laboratories including Oak Ridge and Los Alamos, and many more. At UTSA, there is always a place for you to develop all your talents. I was able to continue playing the harp with the School of Music and around the community while pursuing my studies in the sciences. UTSA truly creates an environment where students are able to learn, grow, and build their paths towards their bold futures. My current position, managing the Extreme Environment Materials Laboratory at UTSA, allows me to cultivate valuable skills such as leading a lab and conducting nuclear research. That's enough about me. Just remember that your bold adventure at UTSA awaits. Back to you, Alex. Giselle, thanks for sharing your story with us. UTSA is all about creating bold futures, and it sounds like you really took advantage of all the opportunities UTSA offered you to do just that. We know you'll be just as successful in med school. Good luck. Wow, it has been so much fun getting to know the University of Texas at San Antonio. Thank you to all the amazing Roadrunners who shared their stories with us. I was so inspired to see so many students pursuing their dreams in big, bold ways. San Antonio is a special city and a great place to be a college student. It's worth taking a closer look. Now it's your turn to learn more about UTSA. You'll be impressed by everything it has to offer. I'm now going to pass it over to President Taylor Amy to wrap things up. Take care, everyone, and birds up. I really hope you've enjoyed getting to know the University of Texas at San Antonio and everything that makes us special, from our tier one classification to our distinction as one of the nation's leading Hispanic serving universities. This is a place where we prepare students to tackle our wonderful, complicated world, to take what they've learned and go out and solve our society's grandest challenges. We want you to become a part of our Roadrunner family. Join us and create your own bold future. Birds up, everyone.